Dear Hollywood, there are too many rated R films these days. Please reduce the number of rated R films you produce by 50% from this point on. I say this because I know you are very concerned with making money. Unfortunately for you, rated R films do not make as much money as PG and PG-13 films, which statistically, PG and PG-13 films make the most money for you. Even G-rated movies make more, mo make more money than R-rated films. Not only do I bring up this concern for you wanting to make more money, but there is another concern I have when it comes to too many rated R movies being made these days. A lot of families would like to go to the movies these days, but unfortunately, their choices on what movies to see are limited because there are so many rated R films in which they cannot take their children to. There are too many movies that contain highly offensive material, whether it, whether it involves crude language, whether it involves sexual content, or excessive violence. But, I, but the reason why I bring this up is that I feel that you can do a lot better when it comes to producing what kind of movies to come out with. For example, last year you produced a movie called Fifty Shades of Grey, which a lot of my friends who saw it thought it was the absolute worst movie ever made. And this year, a parody of that movie, Fifty Shades of Black, was released. A lot of people do not want to see these kind of films. They don't want to see... A romance filled with filled with S and M porn with one person with one lover abusing the other physically. I mean, if you need proof as to what makes a great romance story, I mean, just take a look at some of the works that independent authors have been releasing these days. I mean, take a look at the romance book I released last week, The Elvish Ring, which is available on Amazon.com. All you have to do is read these works, and you will know what makes a good romance story. We don't need, need an R-rated film filled with so much S&M porn, with so much sexual... Well, yeah, with so much sexual content in it. We don't need to see private parts in it. I mean, if you want to see a good ro romance story, I mean, just take a look at my book or other books by independent authors. They can tell a lot better stories. Not only that, but independent authors have the right idea when it comes to what kind of stories need to be told. And some of them, you know, are PG and PG-13. I mean, my, um, like all my stories that I've written are PG or PG-13. So if you need any ideas on what movies to make, just look at the independent authors community. They will tell you what needs to be made. I know that you can do a lot better when it comes to producing movies. And it does not have to rely on R-rated content. Please put a renewed focus on PG and PG-13 films. If you do this, I guarantee you your profits will go up again. Yes, I am aware that 2015 was one of the most profitable years for all of Hollywood. But in my opinion, 2016 is not going to see that same success. Of course, I could be wrong, but until then, I'm standing my... Per by my prediction that 2016 is going to be a worse year for movies than 2015 was. If you want to see improved profits, please renew your focus on PG and PG-13 films and please reduce the number of, of rated R films that you produce by 50% at least. Thank you very much for watching this. Thank you very much for your time. Sincerely, Kyle Eugene Snyder.